So from Dom to Re square, exited back the way we came, past this, and I filmed the lift at the entrance from the MRT station. That's a small lift right there. See it. Stop double helix uh, escalator down there. The ground floor. If we go down another floor, his basement, then down to the MRT station. Going down into the MRT station. Because the train, the right here goes to Sangyan Mitao. Back to this lift. Looks nice. Okay, I Looks nice. Looks nice. Four persons. Very short. Very thin. But still, it has the Mitsubishi efficiency with intelligent leveling. Then it went into the MRT. Now, at first, there was this kind of celebration or something that they promoted event on the internet at Siam. So I went there, so I took this to Silong, then changed the BTS, then went to Siam. Go to Taupun. And down just one level. One level. Just one station. Going out Salem Station, we're gonna take the escalators up, which seems to be right there. This is right there. Uh, two days ago, I went here, Thailand Culture Center. Lifts, BT vandal resistant buttons. We go up to BTS station. This is going to go to BTS Saladang Station, which is right there. BTS Saladang Station. Up above us is the BTS. This post, this pier right here, is actually for the BTS. But the skywalk we're walking on right now is on a separate steel structure. End of the MRT. So now I'm on the MRT, BTS. Ticket. Huh? Ticket. Uh, let's go just. We are here. We're gonna go to Siam. So we're gonna get. Uh, okay. Get four. Ah, insert the money. That's the ticket. Okay. Okay, that's a ticket. Let's go. Salalang Station. International Stadium. Here we are at train level. And look, it is a code. This door is not in use. Let's go back there. National Stadium. Up the BTS I go. So it came in at this station here and 
there's there's two two floors of the platform, and on every floor, so the trains are here, and the event is down here. There's like people everywhere. There's balloons with stuff on it, cables attaching. I saw people going up on the platform and put their heads over the screen doors. It's quite quite dangerous. The security has to move people out from where the train are. So I came down from here and went into the event. Turns out to be nothing, but I, th I think it's just my own opinion on it. Uh, I think it's up to you. You decide is it good or not. But anyways, I went into Siam and filmed some very nice Mitsubishi lifts. Sadly, didn't film any Mitsubishi lifts though, because I need to go somewhere else. But first, this is a treat. I went to the South Lift Lobby, which is right here. Let's go. Cliff lobby. Cinema. South lift, lift number one. I only have not. I don't have much time to film all the lifts. There's lift number six. There's ten lifts in total. This is five guys. The lifts are separated into two sets. So this is one set. There's another set. The lifts now here. She's with the four A. This also called cancel this lift. Looks very nice. The 4A. From here, I went back to the BTS, went back to Silom, then changed to the MRT, then took it all the way to Wat Nangong, which is in Yawarat area, which is the Chinatown of Bangkok. These are the outdoor glass lifts, but they're not fully outdoor, there's glass panels around it. But these are indeed go out on the outside into the BTS back That's Central World Office Tower Lift down to street level Phone time and lift up to the platforms from the concourse level So we changed the destination So now we're going to go to Wat Mangan Station instead This is the other platform, this goes to Tao Poon. There's a cone lift, Pico disc, up to the platform, up to the concourse level. This looks nice. Lower platform, upper platform. Wait, hold on a second. There's no sign saying what platform goes to what direction the trains are going. Which means if the handicap 
person cousin here they have to go to both platforms and check on each platform which direction the trains go on what platform and it's gonna waste time they should have put in some of the signs that say this platform goes to Taupo and the other one goes to Laksong something like that this should be a better design platform this goes to Laksong the upper platform goes to Taupo this is a cone eh? this indicator looks weird This station looks very nice as a landmark, but personally I don't like things that are meant for be landmarks, but I like local things. But never mind, I I'm okay. A cone up to the exit. A cone eco disc. Looks nice. That indicator is weird. That arrow looks so weird. It's like you put the original arrow, the scrolling arrow on a normal cone eco disc indicator, like like this model. They add like a Mitsubishi something into it. It looks weird. Your attention, please. Smoking, eating, and drinking. That's weird. Or on the trains. Thank you. It is a eco disc. All the machinery in here looks nice. Now, Chinatown, yes, there's a new shopping center open up there. It's called I'm Chinatown. Yep, I'm Chinatown with some very nice Shanghai Mitsubishi lift. Exiting the station, there's a road can, in between. There's the main road here. This goes into one of the main big roads that comes from Wollum Hall. And hey, a shop right here. And I'm Chinatown is located right here. Let's go there. This looks nice. I'm not gonna go there. I don't have I'm Chinatown. Finishing it, I'm Chinatown. I went back to the hotel. Back at Banhai Station. The lift. Here. 
ังสภาพนะคะได้ไหมไม่ไหวเราส่งเข้าได้ไม่ไหวแม่แม่แม่ปลาบอกปลาบอกแค่หน้าไม่มีคันนี้เดี๋ยวเรียนไปซื้อพอชี่ Let me take this one down. The indicator is not a normal color indicator. The, the, the color indicator is not like a normal color indicator. It has custom upper platform level. This looks nice. The Talan the Talan extension will open in March 2020. This is open in September. Bangpai Station. Please mind the gap between train and platform. This is a fishing lift. A fishing prop. Thissy is a thissy. Three double. The next day, it came out, and I went into the city. Now, at Top Mount Station, Pakistan Road curves here, the MRT continues here and goes down underground, and there's another section of the MRT and crosses over right here. Yep, and this is one of the most important parts on the MRT Blue Line, because Top Mount, you have the loop of the Blue Line coming attached back again. Which makes this the circle line. Even though it's blue, I mean the circle lines, most of them are in yellow, but it's just a nice feature. Anyways, now this section is called Jalan Sengit Wong. It's on Jalan Sengit Wong Road, which is basically just an, the first outering road of Bangkok. Now, as you see, as you see here, I went to Rajput Road, back at Rajput Road again. Now, this. I went on here, and the left I found the circle Rajput, which has some very nice shops of a resting area. It's a, it's a, it's just basically a resting area. But there's a shop at the back side, which seems to be a multi-purpose building. On the bottom floor is a supermarket. The second floor is a gym. There's a lift here, but it's a generic. Never mind. Let's go. You 
stop there the circle, there's a lift there. No. <coughs> Generic. It looks weird. It looks great. Exiting. Here on another book, then cross with three, four, five, and back to China via three, four, zero. That's the end of the video. Thanks for watching.